Funding is provided by New York State Senator Catherine M. Young, representing Western New York's 57th District. Funding is provided by Absolute Care of Westfield, committed to returning the favor to those who have spent a lifetime caring for others, located on 26 Cass Street in Westfield, New York. Dave Cass and Rick Newell provide funding on behalf of the Lakeview Hotel and Restaurant at the Docks, located on Water Street near the lake in Mayville. From the Chuck Kelsey Television Studio of Access Channel 5 in Mayville, it's Senior Report with Reed Powers. Join us live Saturday mornings between 9 and 10 a.m. in Fredonia, Mayville, and Silver Creek. Call in and share a thought or wish someone a happy birthday with Chautauqua County's only on-air senior program. Reed continues in 2010 with another year of interesting guests expressing their viewpoints and informing the community on a variety of subjects. And now, here's Reed Powers. And what a beautiful day in Chautauqua County. No snow, the roads are clear, it's about 20 degrees, <laughs> and the daffodils are not quite poking up, but the crocuses are getting ready. And another, uh, I say another eight weeks, you'll have crocuses. All right, guys, we have a great program for you. This is an exceptional program. It's unusual. We're going to talk about miniatures, little teeny weeny things that are very realistic, so realistic you believe you're looking at the real thing. And they're created and uh, collected by people all over the world. And we have with us a, a real specialist, Heather Johnson, who uh, has Chautauqua Miniatures over uh, by the Red Brick Barn, and they are going to uh, give us a little stuff here. We're going to take a look at them. We're going to talk about the history of them. We're going to talk about how they're made. We're going to talk about how much they cost and, and the collecting of them, and it's just going to be a fun program. And anybody who wants to call in for any reason, remember, we're your magic market, your magic carpet, right out there on the wonderful World Wide Web. So just call in any time, 753-5225, and you'll be on all over the world. <clears throat> you can give somebody a happy birthday, a clap on the back, a boot in the rear, whatever you want to do, call in. That's the number. And I'm going to give everybody a couple of Big Macs who calls in, and I'll give you $5 off twice at the uh, lovely little place at the foot of the hill. There's two restaurants. One of them, of course, is the uh, uh, is that fabulous, uh, it, it's a new one, it's a fish restaurant, and it's called the Moor, uh, what is it, the, uh, the, the Docks, the Docks as well as the end. You can't go wrong. The Lakeview is, uh, is very well known. It's been there forever. And the two, two side by side. They're wonderful. I'll give you five bucks off there twice. And uh, the first call, you get five dollars off at Topps Friendly Markets over in Fredonia, New York. How about that? And everybody who calls in gets that wonderful, wonderful coffee cup that has been created by the great ceramist, world, worldwide known. It's by uh, the great ceramics in China, and in China signs everyone on the bottom. You'll love it. Okay. Worldwide, you look at the TV, you're getting an awful lot of stuff. I wanted to show you that. They just brought me a copy of it. That isn't that a fabulous little cup? And this will be hand delivered to the first uh, to every caller today. And it's uh, it's our official Channel Five cup. Yeah, the TV is driving you nuts. Of course, all we see these days is Haiti now. It's, it's a disaster over there, of course, and they're trying to plow their way out of it. What do they got? A couple hundred thousand uh, possibly killed and zillions wounded over there in that horrible earthquake. And the world is coming to aid them. And we're getting pleas from uh, our politicians and everybody to send money. You can actually dial on your, on your cell phone. There's a number. And it'll automatically give them um, ten dollars. <laughs> you can't go wrong. <clears throat> but there is a tremendous need and there are, they need shelter and they need food and all kinds of other things. Um, you don't see too much about the two wars that are devastating our country, killing thousands of our kids and uh, 
costing us probably a trillion dollars a year. They don't admit it. They, they hide the money in the military budget and other places. But uh, th this war, these two wars are going on and on and on, and they've been on for, let's say we won the war in uh, Iraq, I guess about uh, almost 10 years ago, according to that, when uh, the President Bush flew in under the, in full gear onto, onto the flat top, and there's a big sign, mission accomplished. <laughs> They're still blowing us up over in Iraq today. Never ends, never ends. We tried to take uh, Afghanistan several times, going back to Constantine, I think back thousands of years ago, and uh, the, the British went in there and got mopped, and then the Russians went in and got mopped, and now we're in Afghanistan, and ex we're, we're sending more and more kids over there. Oh, God help us. Uh, we're giving hundreds of, we're giving trillions of dollars to the banks who stole all the money, and then uh, the ran and <laughs> then said, hey, the economy's going to collapse because we're all going bankrupt now. And so he sent them another trillion dollars, and uh, that's all disappearing into uh, huge uh, bonuses and, and stock options and all kinds of things. And uh, Obama, the other day when he did a State of the Union, said, hey, guys, you know, if you can give these huge bonuses to each other, you're making an awful lot of money. Maybe you could s s pay back some of the dough that we loan you, you know, and uh, use it toward the other banks. And let No, 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 they're not going to do that. <laughs> Health care is down the tubes unless something really remarkable happens. We, we're the only country in the world that doesn't have national health care. And we, we're the only country in the world that doesn't, thereby, thereby pays the insurance companies 30% of all the money for health care. They take it. They use it for profits and swollen salaries and bookkeeping and all kinds of craziness. Yeah, this is a funny world, isn't it? Okay, guys. Uh, let's talk about some of our local news. So I've got, I'm just going to talk about one because I want to get into our program. We've got a really great program here. I do have a couple of announcements for you, incidentally. There's going to be a, a, a great present, presenter, and it's going to give us five key techniques to sharpen your skills. Gary Moll, Toastmaster International Director, professional speaker, consultant, humorist, is going to be speaking at Jewett Hall at SUNY College, Fredonia, February 2nd. That's coming right up. And uh, there's a 6.30 registration, 7 o'clock program starts, and you'll have a great time there, I tell you. you want to be, if you want more information, call a guy named uh, Jetta Rawcliffe, 672-5624. Free admission. They're not making money on this. And it's a great program. Uh, I Take it from me, because I've heard the guy. All right, we also have another note I wanted. There's going to be a, a fabulous uh, pancake dinner at St. Peter's Church in Westfield. Don't miss that. All you can eat for peanuts, six dollars. <laughs> and kids, uh, small kids are under ten or three bucks. <laughs> How about that? Uh, when is it? It's going to be February sixteenth, five to seven p.m. St. Peter's Church. You know where that is in Westfield, right across from Eason Hall, the uh, the center of all action in Westfield. They're going to have, let's see, uh, let me give you a note here. Sausage, cakes, homemade applesauce, beverages, and uh, music, and fooling around. <laughs> Everything you want. Okay, guys. St. Peter's Church, February 16th, in the afternoon, 5 to 7. All righty. Mayville. Now, we are in Mayville right now. Mayville is the heart throb of uh, New York's uh, Chautauqua County. This is the the heart of the county, this is what we call the county seat, although there's no big chair over in the park. There are a lot of chairs over in the park, little pews. <laughs> and they, um, they have a senior group here that's fabulous. And if you don't belong to your senior group, join theirs. It's a terrific group. Anybody's allowed, you know. Most senior groups cross the lines and borders. Anybody who wants to join can. And they're great times because you, you have a second family, you have a support group, you have people who care about you. So give it a try. Uh, I just have a note here uh, from the uh, group, and uh, I want to thank uh, Jean Kelsey. She does a wonderful job here. She sends out the news and keeps it going. Does the, they have wonderful trips. They go all over the country. Yeah, that's, that's part of the senior groups, you know. But I have a couple of notes here, and excuse me if I have to squint this out. Uh, five new members joined them, and uh, they meet at uh, Mayville VFW. You know, it's at the foot of the hill in Mayville, down by the water. And uh, thank the VFW and our, all our other 